Okay, good morning guys. It's your boy Chicle. I'm skipping the intro because I'm just tired. I just woke up, but we did get some news about the next community day on March 18th, and that is Slowpoke. Yes, you can see that there's both the Canto and the Galler Slowpoke. We're going to talk more about that. Subscribe to the channel. Let me know in the comments below what do you think about this community day. First things first, of course, Slowpoke and Galarian Slowpoke are going to appear more frequently in the wild, and if you are lucky, you can get a shiny Slowpoke. And yes, the shiny Galarian Slowpoke is making its debut. That is a point for the community day. Also, the fact that Slowpoke's evolution, Slowbro, can mega evolve, so that's another point. And then you can be able to get all the evolutions. You have Slowbro, Galarian Slowbro, Co Slow King, and the Galarian Slow King. So because you have a variety of evolutions that gives you extra XP. That's three points right there. We have a uh, field notes called Slow and Slower. This is the community day research story that you can buy for a dollar. So if you need some extra encounters for a slow poke or Galarian slow poke, this is a chance to do so. Also the bonus is three times XP for catching Pokemon. That is a fourth point because XP is very important. You need to level up, drop a lucky egg, or lucky eggs and then you can get the XP. Two times candy for catching Pokemon, great because you also have multiple evolutions of both Slowpoke and Galarian Slowpoke. Also two times chance for trainers for level 31 and up to receive Candy XL. Um, lure modules and incense will be lasting for three hours. If you have a golden lure from that whole gimme ghoul thing, you can try that out and you can also increase your odds of gaining some coins. Take a few snapshots during community day for a surprise. We could assume that it's like 50 50 for the both slow pokes and then additional special trade with 50% less stardust for those maximum two special traits. There's a thing called a brain teasing evolution. Before trainers can evolve Galarian Slowpoke into Galarian Slowbro, they usually need to catch 30 poison type Pokemon while adventuring with Galarian Slowpoke as their buddy. But on Saturday, March 18th from 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. local time, trainers will instead need to catch 30 psychic types while adventuring with Galarian Slowpoke. Keep an eye on the clock. This brain branding or bending change won't last past 10 p.m. It is also important that you just evolve your shiny or regular Galarian Slowpoke during that time so you can get the exclusive move Surf. And of course we have the four star ray battles, which again, you can't use remote ray passes for it, but Slowpoke and Galarian Slowpoke are in those raids so if you just need an extra shiny just waste the raid pass and just go for it and then for like another 30 minutes after the raid is over there will be a bunch of slowpoke and slowbro just spawning around and this is going to continue after community day so you can still get some extra chances for a shiny slowpoke there's a time research that can reward you for king's rock and that will last till 10 p.m so that's pretty epic and then a field research there will be multiple research tasks to catch a slowpoke or having some Ultra Balls and some King's Rocks because King's Rock is a special item to help Slowpoke evolve into Slow King. So ladies and gentlemen, I think this is a really good community day. I know it's not like a Fennekin Calm Day or anything, but the fact that we get a new shiny from a different form of Slowpoke is great. And this is a great way to get those evolutions if you need it. It's a good way to catch a lot of Slowpoke so you can get that XL candy. So if you have a really strong Slowbro, you can mega evolve that into Mega Slowbro and max it out. I have a Hundo Slowbro that I use as a Mega Evolution, so I would like to try to get to level 50 if possible, you know what I'm saying? So it's also a great community day for XP grind and all that stuff. So honestly, I think this is a good community day. It's not the most exciting, but it could benefit for what I need. And also, not a lot of people have the regular shiny Slowpoke. May not be the best shiny, but it is rare. Now there's one more thing I want to discuss about before we end today's video. There's this thing called Pokemon Go City Safari. And I think it's like a safari zone, but I don't know, it sounds different. During Rising Heroes, the Pokemon Go will host an all new live event, Pokemon Go City Safari, taking place from May 13th and May 14th of 2023 in Milan, Italy. More details will be revealed soon. So they said it's an all new live event and it's worded as a city safari instead of a safari zone. So I have no idea what that's all about, but at some point we'll get some details, maybe next month or so. 
All I know is that I'm not going to go to Italy. I wish I could go to Italy. It's one of my favorite places I want to visit, but I am broke, so I can't go. So anyway, that's all the time that we have for today's video, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.